Today I'm going to be gathering some materials from this field and attempt to make a bow drill set and then build a fire. There's four parts to your bow drill set. There's your bow, handhold, spindle, and fireboard. So I'm going to see what I can find. I'm also only going to use my knife and maybe the laces from my shoe. In this pile here I found two pieces of willow that could work as a spindle. They're fairly straight. And some dry pine needles. It did rain last night so everything's going to be a little bit damp. This might make a good handhold. Just a very sharp glass, I gotta be careful. This should make a good bow. This might make a fireboard. I'm not too sure, I have to try it out. Here's my bow, fireboard, another fireboard, handhold, some dry pine needles, and two spindles just in case one doesn't work. Uh, besides my shoelace, I need to go find some really fluffy material for my bird's nest. Well, I think I got everything I need. Let's go back to the yard and see if I can build a fire. I apologize, my camera shut off, it was running out of space. But things weren't going that well anyways, so I wanna share with you what I did. I made the hole deeper on my fireboard. My spindle kept popping out. Shaved the bark off, this wasn't spinning very well. I shortened it, it had a bit of a crook in it. This is my handhold. This one was not working very well at all. So I made a hole with my knife and put some green grass in there for lubricant. Now it's spinning good. My lace was a flat lace, so I had to twist it up to make it round. Now that's spinning good as well. I've been doing this long enough now that I was starting to see a bit of smoke, and now it's time to make my V-notch. Wouldn't you know when it started to rain? And now it's time to make the V-notch. I know serrations on a knife are kind of a pain, but sometimes they're handy for being able to saw the wood. No luck yet. I'm trying something a little bit different this time. I'm putting my bird's nest right up to the V-notch. See if I can get some uh, dust to go down in there. One more try. I couldn't get it done. I don't know how many attempts I tried, but every time I go to cut, trim this uh, spindle, I can just, you can just tell by the way the knife's going in that there's moisture in the wood. It rained twice while I'm trying to do this, and that's just the way it is. You know, conditions have to be really perfect. You need dry wood, the right kind of wood, 
and a bit of luck. So close, but I guarantee that if I was to go grab my my dry bow drill set, I wouldn't have a problem. 